A powerful event in Pensacola tonight, bringing together survivors of sexual exploitation and members of the community. WKRG News 5's Alexa Daly shows us how this unique event aims to raise money and awareness while helping to change the perception people have of human trafficking. Because I wore this, an event in Pensacola bringing together survivors of sexual exploitation from around the nation and breaking a stigma. What we were wearing is a question that is asked and it's so stigmatic. It means like maybe we deserve to be sexually exploited, but we're here tonight to show you that it doesn't matter what you wear. It's not the victim's fault. Making a powerful statement, mannequins were placed around the venue, displaying outfits victims were wearing when they were exploited. I was trafficked by my family. I was trafficked as a child. It didn't matter what I was wearing. It was going to happen. All of the beautiful ladies that you see today, it doesn't matter if we were wearing these dresses or naked. It was going to happen because of the situations we were in. Thursday's demonstration raised funds to provide leadership, professional development and mental health services for survivors of human trafficking through the organization Survivor Led Solutions. For the founder of that organization and survivor herself, Alicia Tappan, the event was a vision come to life. Tonight's really special to me. My family's here. All my friends are here. The community rallied. Law enforcement showed up. So I think it's just an opportunity to say, hey, it's not going to happen in our city. But Thursday, Tappan is also honoring someone who stood by her and fought in her corner. As a survivor myself, um, I'm really honored tonight to be able to bring my detective in all the way from out of Minnesota. <laughs> and he came here tonight just to receive an award. I wanted to showcase what it looks like when somebody goes above and beyond. Reporting in Pensacola, Alexa Daly, WKRG News 5.